place here is is very important to to the Penobscot Nation. This is part of our homeland. And this is really the landscape where a lot of our oldest stories come to life. You know, we're in a region here that has been an active part of Maine's forest economy for 150 years. So we started thinking about how we could use a sort of 21st century forest product to, to show that off. The objective for the, for the columns for the visitor contact station was both aesthetic and structural. Obviously we need the, the building to be able to stand up, uh, but the architect was, was adamant that he wanted these columns to look like a, a natural main wood product. And the process of generating or creating a glue laminated column uh, makes them look industrial or almost too finished. So doing it in a plant was, was really not an option. So we had to look at a, a glued solution. A glue lamp is typically a small member that's just stacked one after the other. And we were taking big, big pieces and making really thick members that were flat. Mm -hmm. And so that one little move changed the whole equation. And this picture began to take shape of just how complicated this was going to be. Trying to understand, well, temperatures and moisture and, and grain of the wood, flatness of the wood. So many different factors that we had to learn how to control. We needed the glue to pass the test. Uh, basically, with each failure, we, we picked them off one at a time until the ultimate last testing. Everything you see inside with the clamps and the welding is all stuff that we came up with. I don't know if you could find it anywhere else. The way that we're making the glue line here, it's really unique and that's All handmade? Yeah. No machines? Yeah, no, it's all handmade, which is really cool. Part of the reason that we were hired so young is because we haven't gotten stuck in our ways. I mean, I graduated high school and then two days later I was up here working. So it was like just such a great opportunity that we've all been presented with. The Gaga Bimuk, you know, it's, it's this idea of how far you can see. That is not just reflecting in that we're on top of a mountain, we can see Katahdin to the west, but it's also this metaphor of how far we can see into the future. When visitors arrive here at this building, one of my hopes is that they will begin to develop a relationship with this place, be inspired to go out and experience it for themselves, to get some of that positive feedback that I think we all have, have received from being in this incredible landscape. There are so many ways the respect for this place and the natural world has been incorporated into the design. A lot of times the story of the North Woods starts with the logging industry, but it's so much richer and deeper than that.